One. Jason Eichelberger here, Prep Cow Track. I am with the gentleman from Newberry Park High. Uh, it's becoming a nice tradition here for one of the greatest teams in the history of cross country in terms of prep. Congratulations, gentlemen, the Division II state champions here. I'll have you guys introduce yourselves starting left to right. I'm Aaron Solomon, Nathaniel Schoen, Lex Young, Aaron Cantu, Dave Doshi, Leo Young, Braden Seymour, Arnav Shetty. Again, gentlemen, running the third <laughs> fastest team time at Woodward Park to come away with a championship here. Obviously, coming into this, uh, you guys are not only expected to win, but expected to do fantastic things, and you were able to do that here today. Just talk a little bit about the mindset of the team coming in. In order to get to where you guys want to go later on, I know it's a stepping stool. What did you guys have to do today to get ready to put yourselves in position for next week? Yeah, today is... Uh in a way, it's sort of a trial for next week, you know? It's, uh, it's a way to judge where you're at and a way to just to get that, that mindset starting to build. You know, you're starting to build that anticipation for nationals. It's, it's a super crucial race for us to run. We need to give it what we have in order to be motivated and be ready for what's to come. It's, I mean, the California State Meet, just like when you look at it, it's one of the most competitive state meets in the entire nation. It's, it's a big deal. Uh, we go at it. Uh, Every year we want to we want to do well and it's uh, yeah it's a special race. You guys have put yourselves in such rarefied air um, that you know every time you step out there the expectation level is that not only you're winning but you're doing things that are historical in nature. How do you guys continually race in and race out, push away all the high expectations, but just go out there and execute and get yourselves ready for the next challenge? Um, I think that. The thing is that you can walk into a race, and especially with the reputation that Newbury Park has, there's always a lot of pressure. And the only way to really go through that being fine is if you enjoy the process. And you have to enjoy every single moment of it, no matter how hard it works. Because if you enjoy the race, and if you enjoy everything around it, you're not nervous for the race as much as you are excited. And if you can turn that nervousness into excitement, then the whole team can walk up to the race ready to go out there and have fun and suddenly it becomes this joyful experience where you're working together and testing yourself rather than trying to live up to some expectation. You guys have been on such a historical journey, but every season brings its own challenges and things that have to be overcome. In terms of this year, what has been the biggest thing that you guys have had to do as a team in order to maintain this high level of success that you've set here? No, it's still catchy. Can you repeat it? Sorry. This season, obviously, every season, the journey <laughs> is something that you guys have to start from the beginning of the year to now and then obviously on to postseason. Every year is unique. What was it about this year that led you guys to this moment? Oh, I can say that. I mean, I think that this year has been a really special one. I mean, the coaching situation is different. We've got some new guys on the team. We've lost some guys on the team. Like any year, it's different, but this year is especially different. And I think what that meant was we all, everyone had to be incredibly serious and we had to really focus on what we want and we had to I mean we had to jump in really quick and make sure that we are connected as a team and make sure that everyone is you know united and on the same page when it comes to training we have to learn to attack a workout with this unified mindset the same way we would attack a race you know it's all about making sure that we are a team and I think that if you can be if you can be one and if you can be a team and when you discuss the race plan if everyone can take that to heart and execute it to the best of their ability then you can take on the challenge of a new season that looks completely different with even different people but at the end of the day you're all working together so it doesn't feel different it feels really true to the purpose of what you're trying to do and I think that's how as a team we're able to do what we're trying to do and we're we're really we're united, you know, everyone out there on the course is looking for their teammates, they're looking to get the job done, and that's how we can work together and get what we need to do. do final, it all. final question for you guys, obviously, the state championship is great, you guys are looking for a national championship to cement the best team in the United States moniker, how will you attack that next challenge for you guys next week? Uh, next week is about, it's really just about commitment, you know, it's the very last race of the season for of the team it's going to be our last chance to really just like you said cement our team in history uh it's every one of us knows the gravity of that race it's one that all runners look up to it's sort of like this like ultimate point in running and 
to be able to even have the opportunity to race there is super special, special and we're all very grateful for that. So it's just like, when we're there, everything needs to be, you need to be grateful for every moment, you know? Like, we're always, we're gonna be just living in the moment and be accountable for our own actions and just make sure that we choose how we run, you know? Like, it's, it's the last race. You choose how you do it. Let's, we're, we're gonna make it the best that we've ever done. It's, it's our time to go out with a bang, you know? Well, we look forward to seeing the best you guys have ever done. If there's more in the tank, we're all going to be lucky to be able to see it again. Congratulations, Newberry Park, our Division II CIF State Champions for 2022. These gentlemen have one more mission ahead of them, and we look forward to seeing what they can do. Congratulations, gentlemen. Thank you. Thank you.